multi subobject materials. Multi subobject materials allow us to place materials on different subobjects. So here's a good example. Here we have this model and it has different subregions to it. We can apply different materials to the different subregions to it to come up with uh, multiple materials and subobject levels of the geometry. So what we're going to do here is we're going to create a box. All right, I'm going to pick on it, right click, convert it to an edible poly. Now I'm going to pick on the polygon here. And on the polygon now, each one is, is a separate polygon. All right. Now, if I come up to my materials editor, I can create what's called a multi subobject material. So I click on this button. I come over here and pick on the multi subobject. I'll say OK. It'll ask me to delete uh, the various materials. And I'm not going to do it because I've already had it set up. So I what I do is I set up each material. Okay, so I click on the material, set set it to a diffuse color. I go up to my go to parent. I set on this one here. I made a mapping. In this case, it's checkered. I go to parent. I go to parent. And now I got both so, uh, materials set up for uh, each one. All I can do now is just take and hold the control key down. And go along and pick, and um, I put it on the whole uh, object. But if I pick on this particular object in particular, now I can come along and say, all right, let's grab, drag, and drop it and place that there. All right? So my, ma my material is placed on one of the surfaces. So I can actually come along and say, I want that to go to that particular assignment there. Okay. And now that I got multiple materials on here, and so when I go to go to here, uh, hang on here. So I'm going to my material here, and I got my mapping. Okay. Just double checking here. And now I can go up into my render. And you can see when I render this, it ends up rendering it as two different materials at one time. All right. So I can come back in here at any time and I go to go to here. I can change any material I want. I can come in here and say, oh, let's change it to something else. All right. And I can go back up and Oh, I got a little bit of change going on here, right? And so all I have to do is pick on a particular polygon and I can drag and drop it onto that surface, right? And now I have that particular uh, material there. Now when I go and render it, boom, I end up with that uh, particular material is, is the checkered is showing up on that uh, rendered surface. All right, so I can turn this on the show materials, and you can see that I get different materials on different sub objects of the box. Uh, so the key here is sub objects is we can assign different sub objects. In this case, I chose polygons to assign different materials to that object.